hello everyone so i'm going to tell you how to submit a job and says job on high performance computing facility of iit kanpur and so in order to access that facility uh, you must have uh, your username and password from the facility now you need to install moba xterm in your computer then uh, i'm going to show you how you log in so this is how uh, this is a command for login so ssh minus x and your username dot hpc dot uh, itk dot ac dot in right so here i have set a master password so i was not asked to enter the password so but you will you will be asked to enter the password so you please enter the password and uh, then let's start so what you do you, of course you make us you just make a folder in which you need the following files which you will have from your own computer so those files are data file as well as case file and two more files right so i as you can see i already have data file and i need these two these three more files i will tell you uh, what are those files right so i'm uploading all those files in my folder in uh, moba xterm by the way these folders are in hpc that you are accessing so now i have these files so this is the case file rbc underscore ss dot case and then uh, rbc underscore ss dot dat now uh, this uh, i will show you in another subsequent video what is inside this rbc dot uh, journal file and rbc dot uh, dat file all right so let's just submit the job so what you do you go in that folder firstly cd dt 0p right now you have entered in that folder you can check what are those files inside that folder now you uh, use these two commands dos to unix and uh, then rbc dot journal file so this is the message that you will get unix rbc dot dat file right so again then you just simply q sub and uh, rbc dot dat file right so see it was very easy to submit a job but the problem is what are these rbc dot dat file and rbc dot journal file I will uh, show you in my subsequent video. So, in, to, in order to understand those uh, files, what are those commands that you put inside that files, you can uh, watch my subsequent videos in part two. But here, if you want to check whether your file is whether your job has been submitted or not, as you can see, this is my job that I just submitted. So, yeah rbc dot that all right so okay so couple of more things here so rbc underscore ss dot case so case file you generate in your ansys and you also generate data file in your ansys so uh, you have to do couple of things in ansys uh, i forgot the term okay maybe i'll tell you in uh, next subsequent videos so case file in case file uh, you have to put all the boundary conditions that you need okay and then you initialize the case file initialize in the ansys and then you generate the data file and then you write that data file and case file in your folder in the computer then you import that those uh, files in this mova x term that is interface for your hpc Okay, so thank you so much. Uh, watch my ne next video for understanding rbc.dat file and rbc.journal file. Thank you.